Hello everyone, welcome to Candy Creations, my name is Candice and in this video I'm going to be making some wooden organizers with hooks so that you can keep in your entryway and put your things like mask and your keys and whatever else you need to grab when you're leaving the house so I'm going to stock these for my shop and I thought you guys might like to come along and see how it's made so let's get crafting <music> So my organizers are going to be in the shape of a house because I thought that would look cute. And so I'm just marking where I want to put the holes to um, attach it to the house itself. And I'm just pre-drilling the holes because it helps me to avoid any splitting of the wood when I'm putting in the nails. Now I'm mixing um, my stain. So if you have seen previous videos, I said that I use um, a brown paint and if I want to darken it, I use a little bit of black and I mix it together with some water and I use that to stain the wood and then using my cloth, I wipe it off so it looks more like a stain rather than um, painted on the wood. the roofs are drying I'm just gonna paint the house pieces and I had every intention of painting this a solid white but after that I put down the first coat of white on the wood I kind of liked how I can still see the veins of the wood showing through the white um, paint and I just decided to leave it as one coat because I really like the look next color I'm using is a gray mixed with white and a tinge of blue um, so it looks a bit blue gray almost like a dusty blue kind of color and I'm gonna do the same with this one just apply one coat of paint to the front and back of the house also this gray version has a shelf so that's the little rectangular piece you see me painting here Now of course I couldn't leave these houses just plain grey and white so I really like my stencils so I am cut out a stencil this one says bless our home and then the other one is just um, two birds perched on a branch so I'm gonna apply these onto the houses and then let that dry.
so this is the sawtooth hook that I'm going to be placing at the back of the um, the holder but because it does have a bit of a raise off of the um, wood itself it's going to push the the wood a little more this way tilting the actual shelf itself um, a bit down so anything you put on it may slide off so what I'm thinking to do to offset that push is to put another piece of wood in the back here and that should level things off so when you put it up it shouldn't lean so I'm gonna just paint this piece and then put everything together everything is dry and put together I'm gonna put a coat of polycrylic on the wood and this just seals off the wood from getting any moisture or water damage so you can wipe down the pieces from time to time if you're cleaning out So now I'm going to just measure where the center place point and then install my sorted hanger. Finally, the last step is for me to put on the hooks. Now I have these gold hooks that I spray painted white and I'm just going to screw them in to the front of the sign. everyone thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed seeing the making of these pieces for my facebook shop they came out so adorable i'm definitely thinking of keeping one for myself 
But if you want to find out more information on them, you can click on the link down below in the description box to see my shop. I hope everyone is having a great day. God bless and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.